Okay, I'm 18 and could go to prison for attempted assault and battery for feeding a knuckle sandwich to a 15 year old, so good news for you, kid, I found the less violent alternative. First, if you're gonna call me out, do it right. The word bitch starts with a B, not a P. The letter B makes a bus sound. It is the second letter of the basic Latin alphabet learn to read you ever get buck to. <laughs> really? You had your target cornered and you didn't take the shot? Something tells me you want the credit of a badass without putting in any of the work. Three. Are you serious? I've got height advantage and experience. You're shorter than your vocabulary. I would have fought you with my words, but yours are laced with halitosis. Cheater. <laughs> Four. Violence. It's not the answer. <laughs> Conflict is a cycle of doom. You see, I will kick your ass. Then your bro will call my bro out and I will kick your ass, and your dad will call my dad out, and I will kick your ass. It never ends. Since the confrontation, I've realized that you are a reflection in the mirror that I've grown out of years ago. So while reflecting, here's a few things you should learn. Learn to stop and open your ears. Mouthing off tends to escalate tension in complicated situations. I learned this the hard knock way. And learn to let go. Pride seeps and tokes into our hearts, hollow points, hoping to drag the rest of ourselves down. Opening your palm instead of clutching your fist and locks attention to our bears. I get it, kid. You're young. Full of calm and insecurities plague your better judgment, but the cure is finding the outlet that drains the poison, not the one that mutates it. When I was your age, Confusion was my runaway bandwagon. Loneliness always had its shortcuts and I always had my herbal detours while my inner children were being trafficked by time. Away the day I'd step out, so I picked up a pen and started marking history with my story. You see, writing is an extension of your middle finger. What better fuck you than offending someone who was also impressed by a grammar and wordplay? You see, you see, a fist is a baby's attempt at holding a pen. It's always empty because the concept of being a man can be grasped in the air smashed against the skull, trying to be a man is unbecoming of a man. Living fast and dying young is a boy's idea of a man, and if you live fast enough, I guarantee you will die a boy. And hopefully, you realize this before growing up gets old. So this, this is dedicated to the kid that tried to fight me, and to the kid that I used to be, that I am done fighting, to the both of you, <laughs> I hope to never